I'm Jamie Heber with the Louisville Zoo, and this week we are celebrating pollinators. Pollinators like bees, bats, and butterflies play a critical role in many ecosystems around the world. What they do is they go from plant to plant, and they, they essentially help the plants breed and reproduce. The Louisville Zoo got into the bee business a few years ago because we realized that honeybees are in trouble and pollinators, uh, their numbers have been dropping over the past several decades, mostly due to the indiscriminate use of pesticides, as well as increased urbanization, uh, continued destruction of native wild lands. It's estimated that one third of the human food is grown with the assistance of pollinators. Recently, there was a swarm in front of the zoo, and it was actually causing a little bit of a nuisance and a safety hazard, really. It was right near our ticket windows. And so rather than go out there and just spray the bees, kill them, get rid of them, uh, we called on some experienced zookeepers who work at the zoo to help us solve the problem. So the, the, the beekeepers, the zookeepers, uh, were actually able to go up, safely collect the swarm. They collected the swarm, put it into a box like this, and we were actually able to integrate that swarm of bees into th this, very, this very hive right here. The honey bears love. You probably knew that. There are also other treats that, that bees will produce that we can feed to our animals. Little bee larvae are great treats for small birds that love to eat worms. The bee's wax can be used as an, enrich an enrichment device for the animals to play with. We try to use every little bit of the, the beehive that we collect to engage with our animals at the zoo. Working with bees has taught me to really appreciate and just marvel at their beauty and their symmetry. When you look at the honeycomb and the hive that they produce, it's amazing that just a small insect can come up with these intricate patterns and, and, and such a developed home. Uh, it, it, it's a wonder of the world. People at home can help bees too. There's lots of things you can do. You can plant your own pollinator garden. You can learn more about bees. You can be careful with your use of pesticides by following the label. You could even get your own beehive at home and enjoy the honey yourself. 